Good morning and welcome to Bible Reflection with Anil Arana. Today is the 14th of January 2018. Yet again today we have the same gospel passage that we had a few days ago, but I promise you a different reflection. This is John chapter 1, verse 35 to 42. The next day John again was standing with two of his disciples and as he watched Jesus walk by, he exclaimed, Look, here is the Lamb of God. The two disciples heard him say this and they followed Jesus. When Jesus turned and saw them following, he said to them, What are you looking for? They said to him, Rabbi, which translated means teacher, where are you staying? Jesus said to them, Come and see. They came and saw where he was staying and they remained with him that day. It was about four o'clock in the afternoon. One of the two who heard John speak and followed him was Andrew, Simon Peter's brother. He first found his brother Simon and said to him, We have found the Messiah, which is translated anointed. He brought Simon to Jesus who looked at him and said, You are Simon, son of John. You are to be called Cephas, or Kepha, if you want to be correct, which is translated Peter. This is the Gospel of the Lord. What are you looking for? Jesus asks this question of his apostles. It is a profound question, especially for the seeker of spiritual truths. Jesus wants to know what they are seeking and the reason it is an important question is because the answer will determine the route they will take in life. Let me explain. You try to answer this question now. What are you looking for? Right now, at this very moment in time, what are you looking for? A career, perhaps? Or a partner to marry? Or some adventure? Now, depending on what your answer is, you will go job hunting, spouse hunting, or excitement hunting. Now, any of these are valid things to look for in life, but considering that you're watching this reflection, one suspects that they might be an additional something that you are looking for, a bigger purpose. After all, there's got to be more to life than a career or a marriage or getting kicks from scuba diving. And what you might be looking for, without even realizing it, is God. To quote an often quoted quote, oh, did that sound weird? Never mind. St. Augustine of Hippo said, You have made us for yourself, O Lord, and a heart is restless until it finds its rest in you. Is your heart restless now? Are you looking for God? Well, God has found you. Do you want to know his name? It's Jesus, but don't take my word for it, or even his. There is only one way to discover the truth for yourself, and that is to come and see. And when you do that, you will discover the truth, and the truth shall set you free. So again, what are you looking for.